faith of Noah. And, you know, God told him that there was going to be a, a, a flood. And God didn't just tell him, I will save your family. I will save you and your family. Yes, God said that. But he still gave him instructions on what to do. He needed to do something about it as well. Not just God would do something about it and just come and save them somehow. No, God told him to build the ark. And to build the, the process of building the ark, my God. That is a horrible, I mean, you know, that's a horrible process. 120 years or what? He was building this thing for 120 years just by himself. Maybe some people were helping him, but, you know, that, I mean, he never saw flood before. He, but he still needed to obey. That was where his faith was. You see, it is when you obey the instruction that God gave you and you move forward, you are seeing the invisible and you are moving towards that invisible, doing, going through the process and obeying the instructions. That, is, that takes a lot of faith. So it is faith that brought down those walls. It is faith that brought down, not the shout, but the faith that brought down it. Not the trumpet, but the faith that brought down the walls. It is not the, not the, not the, not the noise. Some people say, oh, it was the noise, there, there was vibration. The, it, is the, it is faith. The Bible tells us it is by faith they brought down the walls. It is by faith. So you, God might tell you to shout today. He might tell other people not to shout. He might tell them to be quiet. He might tell them to do, God will tell you to do anything. But whatever you are facing, you know, there is an instruction for you from God. And this message you are listening to could be your instruction. It might be this is what you needed to do. Maybe you need to do some research. Maybe you need to do some studies. Maybe you need to, you know, you know, where you are praying to begin to get your mind to work and listen to what God is going to tell you. Your walls will come down. In the name of Jesus, your Jericho will come down. But begin to see beyond the walls. Begin to see beyond the walls and begin to walk and move towards that thing that you are seeing beyond the walls. Begin to live a life beyond the walls by faith. And that is your victory. The, by faith, the walls of Jericho will come down. In your life also, through faith, the walls of Jericho will come down. In Jesus' name, amen.